Hey, 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 welcome, welcome, welcome. Sharon Horn Elstrom with the Daily Scare Share. It is day 58. Day 58 of doing one thing a day that scares me. Now, I hope some of you are doing one thing a day that scares you along with me to stretch your comfort zone and just move your life in the direction that you want it to move. Again, I am doing one thing a day that scares me from the book, do one thing a day that scares you. Challenged by my daughter and I don't think she's even watching these, which makes it even funnier, but because guess what? I am still benefiting by doing them every day, whether she watches them or not. And I know I'm not home for about a week or so, but I know when I'm home that she does hear me doing them. So she knows I'm doing them, but I don't know if she knows I'm doing them every day. Well, today is another one of the terrific days that it's got a saying in it. And this actually happens to be a saying that I can really wrap my head around. It is. Even if you're on the right track, you'll get run over if you just sit there. That was said by Will Rogers. And the challenge today or the, the thing you're supposed to do and then fill in the blanks says, the direction I moved on the right track. So what am I going to do today to move on the right track, to move me toward what it is that I'm trying to achieve in, in any area of my life? It doesn't have to be just business or relationships or my physical well-being or my health or my emotional well-being it can be whatever i want so today what do i want to work on well i know i'll be working on my businesses so it's pretty easy every day to do something to move me on my right track for my businesses but i do need to step it up a little bit on my health and my well-being because i am kind of in a rut when it comes to my physical activity and my exercises so I think right here, right now, I am going to commit to figuring out how to set up my laptop on the television and do a yoga class today. I will find a yoga class on YouTube, and I've done a couple of them this year with my daughter, but I've always done one with my daughter. So I'm going to be big, brave me, and I'm going to find a yoga class, and I'm going to do a yoga class on my computer today. And... You might be thinking, well, big whoop share, that's not a really big deal or a comfort zone stretching thing. For me, it is a huge comfort zone stretching thing. I am not a, a yoga person. Now, you'll notice I didn't say I was going to go take a yoga class with other people around. I'm going to do it in my living room on my TV. And actually, not my living room, not my TV, but I'm going to do it in a living room on a television set and I will do a yoga class today. So that will stretch my comfort zone and that's stretching my physical but also my emotional and mental comfort zone because I'm not comfortable doing other things. I'm in a rut of walking and biking on my stationary exercise bike and pretty much doing the same old exercises all the time. But I know I need to kind of change it up a little. So I'm gonna try yoga today. What will you do today? What can you do today to stretch your comfort zone and move toward what you want off that track, get you off that track, out of that rut. I, I know that it works for me just one little thing at a time. I don't have to do massive things, although if I have it in me, some days I will do massive things. But today, it's going to be a yoga class. What will it be for you? Share in the comments below, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.